the Jaguars in their first midweek game. Hampton Hudson in center field. Javante Doris, the first baseman. Xavier Moore at second. Brendan Davis is the DH. Garrett Felix in left field. Bubba Thompson, the shortstop, follows him. Brad Jenkins, the right fielder. William Nelson is catching, and Frankie Montesino is at third base, batting ninth. This is Brandon Kaminer. 15 of them. That's a good fastball, and Davis can't catch up with it. So the first strikeout for Kaminer will step to the dish. It'll be Daniel Cabrera in left field, followed by third baseman Cade Doty and shortstop Zach Mathis. Saul Garza is the DH. Cade Beloso at first base. Maurice Hampton making his first start is in center field. Alex Malazzo, the rookie catcher, is batting seventh. Drew Bianco is hitting eighth in left field, and Gavin Dugas gets the start at second base today for the Tigers. Here is Christian Paul, who's only worked one inning. Making his first collegiate start against the LSU Tigers. Daniel Cabrera rips one deep into right center field, and he is hustling to second base, and he's right there with a slide. Cabrera to protect the folks that aren't paying attention. Garza hits that one up the middle. Second to short for one, short to first for two. A little weird to look out there and see a lefty on the mound for LSU. They haven't had a bunch of them over the last few years, and that's a really nice bender on the outside corner down and away for a second inning of work, and there's actually nobody up in the bullpen. That's pretty rare, so we may see him uh, get extended a little bit today. That throw from third bounces by the first baseman Beloso. You know, they, 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 they program now, it kind of has expectations of of competing for that SWAC championship. Jenkins lofts one into center field. Nelson waits and he drives this one out into shallow right field. It's down in front of Cabrera, a run scores. Bianco drifts to his left. He's got it, the runner from third tags and will make it without a throw and the Jaguars have picked up a couple of runs here. He's probably been uh, the best player to start the season for the Jags this year. Maurice Hampton is right there in straightaway center field. And I praise considering he's had some good ones here. I mean, uh, Michael Papirski was a pretty good, outstanding defensive catcher from the first time he showed up at LSU. So five home runs in the first week or so last fall for LSU. This is hit sharply to the left side. It is clubbed by Montesino as he goes to his left and he turns it into an out at second base. Knows what will happen over the remaining seven innings. Hilliard finds the strike zone, a cold third strike. Davis at second with two outs and a dribbler to the right side. Hilliard's gonna have to cover it. Beloso over to Mikhail Hilliard for the force out. Uh, you know, Burst onto the scene, had a few hits right off the bat, and then got hurt and was out for a couple of months. Dugas is on the move. The pitch is outside. It's ball four. And straight away. Into the left field corner this goes. Felix is circling. He's got it in fair territory. The runner at third tags and makes it easily. And indeed, Zach Mathis produces an opposite field sacrifice fly, pushing across Gavin Dugas. Way through the year. He lines this one to center field. Cabrera rounds third. He will score easily. Saul Garza with a clutch two-out base hit. Sent it right back from whence it came. Just as LSU did in the second inning. Beloso lines this one to right. It is down. Past the diving right fielder, Garza is being waved home. Beloso is on his way to third base, and the big fellow stands there with a triple. And a big baseball fan. Hampton hits it sharply. Thompson on one hop makes the throw over to first base. Pitcher out of Brooklyn, New York, who 18 made two appearances in 2019, sent out the whole year. And oh he nails the runner at first base, Nick Storrs, where they will be watching this, and it won't take them long. Yeah, you can see but he's on the bag there, then the ball hits about a week and a half ago in an LSU scrimmage. Six straight deliveries. Mathis makes the play to second base. The inning is over. 
Uh oh. Way back, this one goes. Don't even think about it. Pucker up and kiss that baby goodbye. Gavin Dugas hit that ball about as hard as you can. His first home run of the year lights the fire right here. He knows he got it right away. And as soon as it hit his bat, everybody in the ballpark knew it was gone. We're being told from our production studio that that ball landed on his mug on the scoreboard, which was up there at that time. He, can, he will add tremendous depth to this bullpen. There's a wicked slider right over the middle of the plate. Brendan Davis is facing stores for the first time, and he has first pitch swinging, and this will be a very efficient inning. As the second baseman retreats, Gavin Dugas has it. Ul Garza and Cade Beloso are scheduled a bat for the Tigers. Mathis getting the start at shortstop. First pitch swinging, and he drives it into right field. A clean base hit. Garza with an RBI opportunity. The 2-2 mm. pitch. Hit high. Hit deep. Way back it goes. You can pucker up and kiss that baby goodbye. Saul Garza hits the top row of the left field bleachers. His second home run of the season. And the Tigers move out with a two-run homer and lead it 6-2. to two. Saul Garza. 190-foot blast out to left field by Garza. And he did all he did was just apply the, the barrel of the bat on the ball. That ball was elevated already. The pitch was way up in his letters. So it would have been a ball had he taken it. But Hampton was a really good player in high school, well thought of as a pro prospect and still is. So That is a terrific play from Montesino. Sino at third base. Take a look, watch the foot. I think he's safe. To Bianco waves at a pitch and goes down on strikes. Garrett Felix finds the fat part of the bat with that one. He came back with another one. Uh, came back with a fastball right there after three straight sliders. First. Cole, third strike. He misses high, and Dugas has been on base three times. First choice in the fourth. Cabrera got a tremendous jump. There won't be a throw. Stole on first move, but the second his foot left it off the ground, he took he took off. And Dugas sends that roller up the middle, and it is grabbed by the shortstop, but he can't make a play. A two-run blast in the fifth. This is hit sharply up the middle. It makes center field. Cabrera scores. The runners advance 90 bases. That's ripped right up the middle and caught by the shortstop, Thompson. Left. Watch this ball sinking, and Thompson reacts to it and makes the play. The top of the order has flied to center twice and reached on a fielder's choice. This one is bunted nicely. Beloso's got it and throws late to first. Work with, and 13 of those 16 had, had experience. Out at second base. Malazzo. Florida leads Jacksonville, one nothing in the fourth. Cabrera sends a liner to left field, and it carries out to Felix for the third out. With two outs and the full count. Strike three called. Beck comes all the way back. School in Shreveport. And there was another great player out of Airline High School by the name of Todd Walker. This one goes way back the other way. You can pucker up and kiss that baby goodbye. The first home run of his LSU career. An opposite field drive. Hayden Travinsky. Beloso chops one off his counterpart. It's rerouted into right field. Hampton sends a liner to center. Nelson is back, and he gets there for the out. Behind the plate, so both brothers getting a chance to play tonight. Here's the throw from foul territory, and it's not in time. And then the following Wednesday against Louisiana Tech. 
That liner just clears the leaping Cranford. The runner rounds third and falls down and has to return to third. The 2-2. Swing and a miss. Costello finally got it by right. It Ground ball right side. Belozo will flip it over to Costello for the out. Mathis in foul ground, squeezes it. And that's all for the Southern Jaguars in the ninth. A run on a couple of base hits, two left.